Some local college students are using their brains to help with heavy lifting. Two RIT seniors invented the strong arm lifting system. News 8's Caroline Tucker reports on the back saving invention. Often when people go to pick up a heavy load, they do it the wrong way, bending over and then they throw out their back. So that's where the strong arm comes in. Well, I can't actually bend over with the straight back here. I have to actually get down in a natural squat and attach to my package right here. It's an invention that helps with the heavy lifting to RIT seniors who started with a simple problem. We we're walking back from the gym, watching some people here at RIT actually just haul stones, building a large wall and they were killing themselves. So Sean Peterson and Justin Hillary went to work. Started with a string in, in our dorm room. We spent, I don't know, three months just studying body mechanics and different things like that. Prototype after prototype, the two came up with their lifting system, retrofitted in a vest. Being in proper form takes extra effort. Um, but what we're doing right here is we're reminding you. It consists of a series of strings that act like pulleys. The concept of the strong arm really, it starts with the, the arm length. The vest can help someone lift hundreds of pounds and do it without injury. The main issue is taking the load off your hands, which is usually weaker and causing a lot of carpal tunnel. And what we're doing is we're distributing those loads to the body. The students say billions of dollars are spent each year to compensate for injuries due to lifting in the workplace that's their marketplace. We are planning to partner with any company that's in, there in the industrial garments market. Both young men have fathers in construction, so it's a business plan that in the end is very personal. I've seen my dad and people in my family and a lot of his friends suffer with uh, back injuries and just giving people that that extra support and you know it's a long the longevity we want people to work for longer periods of time to not have to suffer like Caroline Tucker News 8 those RIT students recently had a patent approved for their invention they're in talks now with companies to get it into the marketplace